fever, runny nose, headache, <coughs> cough. It could be COVID-19. A new study shows that the safe and effective holistic option, it may prevent and treat it. Also, what this means for your pets. And at the end of this video, I'm announcing the winners for those of you who entered the contest to win free dog or cat supplement. Hello, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. I encourage you to sign up for my brand new Q&A webinar in which I'm answering the most pressing dog and cat health questions. And I'm giving you my top natural remedies. It's happening on Thursday, January 27th. You can click the link in the box below to sign up. We're currently in the midst of the fifth wave of COVID-19, we've got this Omicron variant. You know, millions of people are currently affected worldwide. This variant has been able to overcome even those people who have vaccine immunity. So what's this new study I'm talking about? It was published in the National Institutes of Health and I'll put a link to it in the description box. It's titled CBD or cannabidiol, how it inhibits the virus that causes COVID-19, SARS-CoV-2, as well as stimulating host immune response. First, the authors reported that CBD cannabidiol it inhibits and blocks replication of the COVID-19 virus in the lung epithelial cells. You know, it's actually blocking COVID-19 infection. Say that you're infected with COVID-19. Secondly, it acts on the immune system. It actually stimulates interferon production and it says it upregulates the antiviral immune response. A previous study showed that people that have been regularly taking CBD chamomile they're having a lower incidence of COVID-19 infection. And their conclusion is this study, it highlights the importance of CBD and the prevention and treatment of COVID-19. So it's hard to believe that this stuff, little old CBD, I've been popping it and I'm not feeling so well. Well documented for pain, inflammation, for treatment of seizures, but to see it as an antiviral, I mean, that's huge. See the anxious poodle there? How do I get her less anxious specifically while she's on the exam table? None other than CBD, which she really, really likes. Mm. You know, this still needs to be peer reviewed and needs to be replicated. But that being said, it's pretty darn exciting like, to see CBD chamomile as you know a preventive and a treatment for COVID-19. They're not publishing specific doses. But as far as the general guideline of dose, it's about three milligrams per 10 pounds of body weight once to twice daily. Then it has me also thinking about some of the benefits in our animals and what viruses that may or may not be effective are in our dogs. Maybe the respiratory viruses, you know, for instance, canine influenza, parvovirus, right? It's so difficult to treat and or prevent. Wouldn't it be great if you could just use CBD for that? What about our cats, you know, dealing with the upper respiratory viruses, herpes virus, Khaleesi virus? Wouldn't it be awesome if we could consider that with CBD? And then some of the more serious infectious viruses that our cats get that are so difficult to treat. You know, feline leukemia virus, FIV virus. How about FIP virus? It's actually a coronavirus. Imagine if we could be using CBD in our cats that had FIP. You know, that would be awesome. It's awesome news specifically with what we're going through in this pandemic to, you know, have this like effective, safe, holistic option. Thanks again for watching. And if you yet to do so, I encourage you to sign up for my brand new Q&A webinar in which I'm answering your most commonly asked questions about your dog or cat. Then we're gonna be giving you my top holistic remedies. It's happening Thursday, January 27th. You can click the link in the box below to sign up. So the winners of the dog supplement are Life with Tammy and Dean, LC, Vinny, Chinook Valley and Amber Weber. The winners of the free bottle of cat supplement, the Creative Chica, Beverly Cass, B. Bailey, Justin Louise, and Barb Badger Jansen. Thanks so much again for all of you who entered and left me some like great, great comments and video suggestions. Super appreciated. Once again, and thanks for watching the video. It's Dr. Jones.